Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie's friends believe their kids need better nannies because some of them have gotten hurt over the past few years. That's the claim in one of this week's tabloids. Gossip Cop looked into the situation and we've exclusively learned the truth. Pitt and Jolie's 11-year-old daughter Shiloh broke her arm while snowboarding on a family vacation over the holidays, but the young girl is on the mend. Meanwhile, the estranged spouse's 14-year-old son Pax injured his leg during a trip to Thailand in 2015, while their 9-year-old daughter Vivian was seen sporting a small band-aid on her forehead last year. Of course, it's not at all unusual for children to sustain minor injuries on occasion, especially when they're as active as the Jolie Pitt brood. Unfortunately, the National Enquirer is sensationalizing the situation by alleging that those close to the exes fear for the safety of their kids, and think they need more attentive nannies. The magazine quotes a so-called source as saying, Why ISNTNG making sure Shiloh plays safe if she can't be there, then a responsible adult needs to be. The seemingly made-up insider further purports that Pitt is frustrated by his estranged wife's relaxed approach to childcare, adding, Brad and Angie clashed over her lack of discipline when they were together, and he has little to say about it now. Despite the magazine's account of events being blown out of proportion, Gossip Cop still checked in with a source close to the Jolie Pitt family to get to the bottom of this. We're exclusively assured that no one in the ex-couple's inner circle is worried that their children aren't being cared for properly. This is simply a non-issue. It's worth noting, Gossip Cop called out the Inquirer last year for attempting to turn one of the Julie Pitt kids' minor bruises into a major trauma. After Vivian was spotted with a small cut on her forehead last year, the disreputable magazine described the child's scratch as a vicious head wound, and then alleged Pitt and Julie were at war over the incident. This latest article is similarly absurd, 